At Cato Lime, your voice matters. Our voting system rewards your participation and gives you the ability to greenlight the next great film. And so today, we want you to better understand how this whole voting system actually works with this very brief overview. What we'll go over is how to participate, what goes into your scores, how to maximize your scores, and a few other tips and important items along the way. Oh, by the way, we named the score that a screenplay gets from you an allori. It means praise, achievement, laurels in Italian. So let's get into it. The first thing to know is how you can participate. You participate in two ways, review and vote. First, choose any screenplay in the competition, then review and cast your vote for it. There are three ways to review a screenplay. Number one, reading a screenplay. Open your screenplay and begin reading. When you finish reading, you have the ability to cast your vote. A reading vote is the highest valued vote. Number two, listening to a screenplay. If you're on the go or prefer a good listen, KetoLine provides a built-in script reader that will read it for you. And you can bump up the speed of the audio as well to move things along. When you finish listening, you have the ability to cast your vote. A listening vote is a medium valued vote. Number three, watching a video podcast. Beginning in round two, Kinolime offers an accompanying video podcast for the top 30 winners from round one. This is essentially a video recording of a table read of selected scenes from the screenplay to give you a sample of what the whole screenplay is like. Podcasts are recorded in our studio and are co-hosted by our head of development, John Schramm, and actor, comedian, writer, Brett Rabel. They're also performed by two professional actors. Podcasts run approximately 15 minutes, so very snackable. Um, and when you finish watching, you have the ability to cast your vote. A podcast vote is a low value vote, but let's pull back and go over all of the factors that go into your score. There are three scoring factors, content type, votes, and voting frequency. So content type, we've already kind of gone over this, but it's really how you review a screenplay, whether it's reading, listening, or watching a podcast. Each of these represent a high, medium, and low value in your vote. Therefore, choosing your content type will impact the value of your vote. By the way, you earn tokens regardless of the content type, which you can redeem later. The second factor is your actual votes. So once you've completed any of the three types of content, a voting panel is unlocked. The voting panel is included in a larger questionnaire so we can learn more about your thoughts on the screenplay. But here, your individual perspective matters. Reading and any other feedback you provide when voting is directly and precisely translated into the screenplay score. And the third factor, vote frequency. Kinoline places a greater value on those who review by reading screenplays frequently. The more scripts you read, the greater the value of your votes. Okay, let's sum it up. To maximize your vote or help your favorite screenplay advance in the competition, we found the quality of the screenplay is best assessed when one reads a screenplay. 
And so a screenplay that you read on Kinoland.com earns the highest points, followed by listening, followed next by watching the podcast. Furthermore, the more screenplays you read, the higher your impact, which will significantly increase the total Allori score you give. So the cumulative Allori's determine the top 30 or the top 10 screenplays in our competition. Bottom line, read, 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 read some more. But one more thing, once submitted, votes cannot be changed. However, reading a script overrides any previous votes from listening to the same script. In other words, a vote from listening can be replaced by a vote from reading. For more help with the voting system, our support team is available via live chat and email. And I would also encourage you to check out our help center where we attempt to provide answers to your frequently asked questions uh, in as much detail as possible. But finally, thank you so much for participating in this new way to make films. We so greatly appreciate your input. And you know what? Let's make a film together.